Hello and welcome to episode 48 of my Planet Explorers tutorial Let's Play series. This episode will be on doing the quest Language Arts. So you'll remember from the last episode that there's this pointer down here, the Pujan ship, and also up here the Pujan launch facility. I need to go to both of them and explore them uh, to see if there is these language samples. So there's the ship. Let's keep going and see if we can get that. It did seem a long way off on the map, but it's not really. I know the other one is, but this one isn't. Now I'm wondering whether I should land my wooden plane on this ship because I think I've got to get across this water but I don't know if there's going to be hostiles on this ship that are going to destroy my plane uh, right well let's go down here see if I can get a little bit more onto this boat without updating the quest. I'd prefer to be out of my plane when the quest updates. Okay, let's exit and let's get my plane back. Because I like it. It might be made out of wood but it's still very cool. Okay, so here we go. Let's now go and get a quest update. Got to go in there. Oh, something's happening. Yep, here we go. That was lucky. I landed right by the entrance. I guess there's a first for everything. Now I'm guessing this is going to be full of hostile aliens because that's how it normally goes. Okay, if I look at the map. Yeah, so what we need to do is search this ship and I imagine there's going to be lots of fighting but at least I've got my lovely class 3, um, oh, what are they called even, my sentry type freeze to keep me company. They do an amazing job with the aliens. Uh, okay, I can't do nothing there. It looks like I've got to go down here so let's do it. Why is he walking so funny? This does look really cool. Doesn't seem to be much sound in the game. Uh, no doubt it's just going to start blaring out in a moment. So I guess I'm searching for a language sample. And I guess it will give me some indication when I get near it. But that's one of the things I like about Planet Explorers. You've really got to work it out, a lot of the stuff. Trial and error. And in my case, mainly error. Ah, what's that? It doesn't look friendly. It's a red blob, and that means it's going to be full of pain for me. And it's hanging up there from the ceiling. So, looks like I might have to walk along the corridors. So let's go this way around. I just know it's going to be shooting at me. And I bet it's just got an excessive firepower. Oh, it's actually in the water. Oh, look at that. Looks like a nasty big shark. I thought it was that thing hanging off of the ceiling. But that's one of them that's been strung up by the aliens. 
so it looks like I've got to fight this in order to get this language sample. I'm guessing it must have eaten it. Or must have eaten the person that had the language sample. Oh, here we go. Now, can I put a turret on there? Oh, yeah. Now, how cool is that? Has it got energy? Yeah. Oh, I should have charged that up. No, it doesn't look like it is firing. Let's give it back. I really don't want to go down into the water. It don't look like I've got a lot of choice. Ooh, something happened then. Can you fire? At least they're waterproof. That's something about these, which is cool. That is one big fish. Anyway, let's put a turret down. Or two. Yeah, that's better. Oh, it's one of them creatures which is extremely tough. Let's turn the sound down. And it's going to chew through my turrets, no doubt, in a minute. Oh, look at that. Just blown one of my bleeding turrets up. I'm not a happy bunny. Um, let's see. How is my gun? This is going to keep shooting my turrets up. I'm not that. Look, it's destroyed another one, the leader. And it's got so many hit points, this thing. And it ain't gonna have any loot on it, that's for sure. Oh, it just shot at me. Oh no, not my gun. Shoot me, not my gun. There we go, I'll protect my gun. Alright, I won't protect my gun, it's destroyed it. Oh, something's going on. Either it's saving or it's lagging. Okay, so I've managed to get a little bit of its health down. Not a lot. Feeling good. I don't know what she's... I don't know what they're saying. I just wish they'd kill this poxy thing. Yeah, this is going to take half a day to kill, for sure. Uh, and I can't even use my turrets anymore, because it's just going to destroy them. I'm wasting them. Um, of course, there is a plan B. I'm not sure that I can do this, but let's try it. No, you can't build. I wanted to place one of my bigger turrets, but you can't place them indoors. So the only thing that I can think of is placing one of my sentry guns where they can shoot it, but it can't shoot them. So I'm wondering the range. Oh no, look, it's got heat-seeking missiles, this fish. So, you know, this is obviously a new type of species that's evolved uh, to being able to launch missiles at you. And there's two of them now. They've self-replicated as well. Yeah, it's got lasers and, and heat-seeking missiles extraordinarily extraordinary fish live on this planet and there's two yeah there's two of them there's no way I'm gonna do this for goodness sake how about I just search around to see if I haven't got to actually fight them I bet I have though yeah no that's just look at that no that's just too many missiles for my life oh yeah and it's killed me I'm glad you do, I don't. I've still got to kill these things. Right, okay, so that's the dead zone down there. There's no way that I'm killing them. But I believe I may have to. I've got no choice in the matter. If I want to continue with this quest chain, then I'm going to have to somehow, miraculously, kill these things. Although I don't see, I really don't see how. 
Unless I've got to just get by them. Let's try that. <clears throat> I don't think there's any killing them. It'll take too long and too many resources. But have I got another option available to me? Do I have to simply go by them? Sometimes running is the better way of valour. Right, okay, I've got past them. Oh, I do hope I don't have to kill them. I wish I hadn't have wasted my turrets, but never mind. At least they can't come on land. They might send out heat-seeking missiles, but they can't come on the land, thank goodness. No, there doesn't seem to be nothing up here. I'm guessing it will show me something on the mini-map. Now, can you stop playing with them fish and just come and join me, uh, whatever your name is? Okay, let's try going up here. Wow, if this is what the ship's like, I dread to think what that research facility's like. Oh, what's this? Yeah, here we go. Now we're cooking, so I didn't have to kill them. I didn't have to waste three of my turrets, or four of them. Oh, so annoying. Never mind. At least you watching will know that you don't have to stand and fight them. There we go. That's what we want. Let's grab it and get the heck out of here. Of course, I need to go back past them, but I'm certainly not going to waste any more of my gun turrets. Yes, there we go. That's what you do there. Let's see now how far we can get towards the next point. Really, I ought to heal a little. And let's have a nibble. There we go, full health, full food. Let's see now if I can get back by these nasty, heat-seeking nasties. They really are an advanced type of fish. Oh, here we go, it's saving or doing something. Okay, well, it looks like I could have used platforms to get across here rather than swimming with them. Only so far, though, but that's good enough for me. I'll just check my pack self across here. There we go, look at that. Isn't that cool? Right, let's get out of here. Oh yeah, it's trying to shoot, it wants a piece of me. It's not getting it, it's had enough. Had my touch sentry turrets. Okay, let's get out. So yes to that. I'm hoping that this should just be saying what it's saying. The main thing is that this is updated. I'm really hoping that I don't have to kill both of them big fish in there. <clears throat> because of how strong they were, I don't believe you have to. I believe they're, they're just there to distract you. But not necessary to kill. You just gotta love that jetpack. Right, okay. Let's now venture forth to the next one. Now what I can do, of course, is teleport to here, because it will bring oh no, I don't think it's worth it though, is it? It's only a tiny little way. Yeah, no, it's not worth it. Let's just use the plane. And hopefully by the next episode I'd have made it. At least I'm pointing in the right direction, that's something. This plane does move nice and quick though, which is very cool. And I never noticed the energy bar below before, I guess I'm just blind, but 
that's very cool. <clears throat> Down here we can see how much energy I've got left. Oh, there's the timer. Well, I suppose there's no point in watching me flying over this vast distance that I've now got to go to here. So what I'll do is end this episode here and start the next episode when I'm just before it. Wherever you are in the world, God bless you and keep every last one of you safe. Thank you for watching and have a fantastic day. Goodbye.